Hello YouTube, this is Christopher Maros and today I'm going to show you how to install Joomla 4 on a WAMP server on your own local computer. So we've got WAMP server running right here, it's all set up and ready. And now we're here at the Joomla 4 download page and we simply click to download Joomla 4. So we choose the latest package which at the moment is Joomla 4.2.3 and uh, we just download that it's 28 megabytes for now and this is a good size for Joomla because it has a very good structure below that you can use to create your own extensions or build your website so here's the download package I just copy and paste it into my www folder where I've created uh, the name of the website I want to create so I'm just gonna call this tester 423 and I extract the package right here everything from uh, Joomla all of its contents is extracted right here I can now delete the download package So we've got this uh, directory with all Joomla 4 contents and this is the page, the page where you can access you, where you can access it, the directory where you, you've got your website. As you see, I accessed it before and it was empty. Now I can just refresh and you see the installation uh, of Joomla. I'm just going to select English for all of you. Now, uh, come on. All right. Now we can set the side name here. Let's just say that this is tester423. Now, the next step is to set up your login data. Now you've got the real name of the super user, that's Christopher Marvels, that's me. You can use your name. <laughs> and uh, the username for the uh, super user account, I can just write test of four, three, three, two, three. And a password for your user, super user account. I'm just gonna write something here. Okay at least 12 characters okay and then again the, the email of the super user so now here we've got the real name of your super user a username that you can use here the password of your you super user account and your email address you can write whatever you want here now let's set up the database connection and here's the trickier part for uh, everyone usually that's the hard part don't worry it's it's really simple let's see you've got to select the database type that's usually just my skill I I'm I mean if you're using one server the latest version I'm using 327 with PHP 8 Apache uh, Apache server 24 and MySQL 5 7 that's okay then you can just select MySQL I. You don't have to use the old one. So here's the host name. It's usually localhost. Since you're uh, installing Joomla 4 on your own local computer, you can just write localhost. Personally, I prefer to write uh, 127.0.0.1. It's basically the same, only that uh, your uh, computer does not try to resolve the, the local host name to the IP address. You just directly write your local IP address uh, and it works. Now here you, you should write a username and a password for uh, your database. That's completely different and irrelevant to the ones you set up before for the super user. These ones are the ones that you use in the database. If you don't know how to do that, you can go into your PHP MyAdmin and find out or create a new user. 
I've created a user here and that's Joomla and guess what the password is Joomla so here you can write the database name uh, it's a good convention to just leave Joomla underscore there and uh, write your uh, your website name here I'm just gonna write Joomla underscore tester 423 because when you do that PHP might mean automatically groups your uh, databases based on the prefixes so I'm just gonna leave this one here as it is if you want you can simplify it for example you could write T423 T from the example test of 423 or you can just leave this one it's good to be automatic because uh, in Joomla 1.5 it was JOS uh, always if I remember correctly and uh, it, it was a, a problem then so now you just have to click install Joomla and basically that's what you need to do okay let's uh, let's let's leave this for now so the, the Joomla side is ready here you can install additional languages I'm not gonna do that for now and uh, here you can open your site or the administrator I'm just gonna open the administrator here is tester 423 Joomla administrator and it's ready you can log in okay yes I'll help Joomla why not help Joomla and uh, here you can see your website it's ready ready to use that's all any questions or ideas feel free to comment like this video or subscribe thanks a lot for watching